when we follow Jesus, the Holy Spirit, who is God, comes to live inside us and he makes us more like Jesus. In God's true book, we're told that he does this in nine ways. This is the fifth way the Holy Spirit makes us more like Jesus. He makes us more kind. This is the fifth fruit of the Spirit. Kindness. Kindness is an ongoing attitude where you want the best for other people. It means we do what we can to make other people's lives as good as they can be. But there's one thing that Christian people can do that is kind that everyone else can't do. Let me explain. The Christian good news is that God made the world and loves the people in it. But all of us know that we have walked away from him. We've chosen to do things which are wrong and, and not right. The great news is that Jesus came and took our punishment, which was being abandoned by God, when he died on the cross and he rose again to new life, letting us know that if we say sorry for the wrong things we've done and believe in King Jesus, then we can live together with him forever. That means that God was kind to us in sending Jesus and giving us eternal life. And that means that if you believe in Jesus, you are going to live forever. Now, that is amazing, isn't it? That means that even when our bodies stop working, we can live forever with our kind God. So everyone in the world can be kind to each other. And the world would be a lot nicer place if people are kinder to each other. But Christians have something extra. We have the good news of Jesus Christ. Think about it. The kindest thing we can do is tell other people about Jesus and the kind God who rescued us. So why not, with a mum or dad or carer or friend, talk about that now? Why not ask them what they think about our kind God and the good news of Jesus Christ?